sometimes my intrusive thoughts are like they're not always like harmful they're like like pressuring me to be productive <laughs> Leave looks really good. The courage looks really good. That's weird. That's suspicious. Welcome to the vlog. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, welcome back. If you've been here before, hey. It is currently 6.48. It looks a little bit dark out. Um, it is dark out already, but it's not that late. We just got back in from a day of shopping and we went on a little date, a little late lunch, early dinner, and I got some goodies. I got, I got spoiled a little bit and I wanna show you guys what I got. I'm drinking some tea. All I drink these days are water and tea. Um, since I've been pregnant, soda is not the vibe. If I drink soda, it will, like, it's just disgusting to me. <laughs> I don't know, soda's just gross to me. Maybe once this pregnancy is over, I will go back to soda. But as of right now, I went to Five Below and Ulta. We went to other places too, but this is just where I got stuff. I've been so into Five Below lately. Like, I haven't even been like shopping at the mall and stuff lately. I wanna go to like Five Below Marshalls, TJ Maxx, Burlington. Like, I've been deal hunting. <laughs> I've been like deal hunting and Hello Kitty hunting. I don't know, I'm just on that vibe these days. All right, so first I got this bag. It is like a tote bag. I bought it for groceries to bring with me into stores and stuff because currently where I live, I live in Maryland, um, and where we live, they are completely doing away with plastic bags, and now we're using only paper bags, and we're gonna have to start paying for paper bags in the next coming weeks. So I'm getting my reusable bags and my tote bag game up so that that's not gonna be a problem for me. I'm sorry, I'm not paying 20 cents a bag. <laughs> I'm just not doing it, okay? I don't know. I don't know, and it's only a couple cents a bag, but like it just irritates the F out of me being charged for bags. So I'ma just use a bag. It's better for the environment. Next from Five Below, we got this wet or dry brush. Um, my hair is very thick, Brandon's hair is very thick. Our daughter's hair is very thick. So we're always looking for good detangling brushes. So really excited to try this. It's a gently detangling brush. It looks really good. And then I saved the best for last. Um, I'm not a Hello Kitty girl. Like I don't I don't feel qualified enough to classify myself as a Hello Kitty girl because the Hello Kitty girls don't play. You bitches don't play. Y'all be getting Hello Kitty tattoos and whatnot. So I don't consider myself a Hello Kitty girl, but I am on a super girly pink like Hello Kitty vibe kick right now. So my boyfriend got me this little Hello Kitty blanket. Um, I'm probably going to leave it at my vanity, but we'll see. Because my room is white and gray, so I don't want this to like clash with the neutrals, but at the same time, I'm like, girl, have a little bit of fun, you know what I mean? But yeah, so I got this adorable little Hello Kitty blanket. So cute. Boy, yeah, you're right. Look. Next, I got some makeup. I got some goodies. Oh, <laughs> nothing crazy. Just some stuff that I wanted to give a try. So I have been doing like this quick little five minute makeup routine and it's been just concealer, no foundation. I wanted to get like a tinted moisturizer to bridge the gap because I don't like how it looks all the time when you just have one concealer and you have no foundation on. So I got a tinted hydrator. This is the Wet n Wild Bare Focus. It has hyaluronic acid. I actually bought two of these because we got one for my little sister as well. Um, 
but we already dropped it off at my parents house and then i got a gel lip liner this is wet and wild as well this is in the shade gone burgundy it's a little bit darker than the one that i use every day right now which is wine by kiss oh my god <laughs> why am i dropping everything it's a little bit darker than the one i use right now so i'm really excited to try it i think it's gonna be i think it's gonna be bomb i think it's gonna be a banger and then i have been looking at all the targets in my area for the elf lip oil i am so happy that i found homegirl i'm so happy i found her so yeah i got the elf lip oil i got it in crystal clear like just the regular clear shade i didn't get it in any of like the tinted colors you guys saw that i worked with wet and wild recently and i have been saying like i really love getting sponsorships and like brand deals with companies that i actually love and actually use um i don't think i've ever tried a wet and wild product that has been bad or like has not worked um i love wet and wild and i'm really on a wet and wild kick right now because if you guys saw in my what i got for christmas video they sent me so 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 so, so much makeup when i collaborated with them and all the makeup i knew that i wasn't going to use from the like pr box they sent me i split with my mom and my sister and then i kept a bunch of it as well but like wet and wild has just not been missing like they do not miss so i have really high hopes for this tinted moisturizer since we already had late lunch early dinner we don't really have to cook dinner tonight and my daughter is still down for her nap maybe asleep for the night so i get to have just some time to myself to relax unwind chill and like do my little nighttime routine also update on the nail glue if you guys saw my pregnancy self-care night video um i told you guys i was trying a new nail glue it is the wonder bond Everything that I mentioned, I will have linked down below, but I also will have this link down below because it has been days. I have not lost a single nail. I am dead serious. I'm not lying. I think I'm going to make a TikTok about this nail glue because the TikTok viral nail glue by Beauty Secrets that went viral is sold out everywhere. And so I need to put the girlies on. I need to let the girlies know that this one is really, it's really like that girl. This one's really good. Um, I have not, I'm not joking guys, no nails are lifting, no nails lifting, I haven't lost a single nail, not once, so very excited about that. This is my new press-on glue. This has reignited my love for press-ons because at first I was like, I hate having to travel with glue, I hate having to reapply nails, baby, none of that. I wash dishes, I shower, I do bath time with my baby, I do my hair, I do her hair, no nails lost last night i got my hair tie stuck in my hair and i was like fighting it out and i was thinking to myself i'm about to break a damn nail and i was so pissed off no nails lost so excited about it Black women are really magicians when it comes to hair because the fact that I could fit all my hair in this little bun, I was like, I just wanted to look as small as possible. Like, I like wrapped my hair around when I was pulling it back into the bun. But anyways, as you guys saw, I have been cleaning most of this morning. Mm -mm. All of this morning. The only thing I've done other than clean is 
make breakfast. Aurora had cereal because she has been on a cereal kick lately. So she had cereal and strawberries and I had a bacon, egg, and cheese sandwich, which is what I was gonna make her, but she didn't want it. She said she wanted, she said she wanted cereal and strawberries. I said, okay, girl boss, do you? And most importantly, I finally cleaned my closet. I didn't film that. Now that I'm pregnant, I don't want to go in there and like, there's 200 shirts in there and there's only 25 that can fit me. I don't wanna do that. So I went through my iPad, it's ready for update, perfect. But I went through and got rid of all the clothes that don't fit me anymore. I put them in a bag and I'm not gonna throw them away. I'm gonna wait till I lose my weight again after pregnancy, see what I'm still into, what still fits, what I wanna keep. For now, it's just gonna go in a closet, I'm not gonna be over zealous and throw anything away. But let me show you guys my closet. It has not been organized literally since we moved. I have not had this many, this little clothes in a closet ever in my whole life. So let me show you. Let me show you what my closet looks like. Guys, there's nothing in here. Um, dresses, bodysuits, all my shirts, pajamas, leggings, shorts, skirts, sweats, jackets and cardigans jeans jeans non-jean pants dirty clothes so my closet is so condensed like i'm so proud of myself i'm gonna really try my hardest to keep it neat because i have been putting off not putting off but i've been like trying to make the time to clean up my closet for about two weeks i have been saying it in a bunch of my past vlogs too so if you keep up like you i know you guys have heard me like keep talking about it but I just haven't gotten around to it. And today I just had a burst of energy and I was like, girl, do it right now. Do it right now. Like sometimes my intrusive thoughts are like, they're not always like harmful. They're like, like pressuring me to be productive. Like girl, do it right now. It don't matter what else you gotta do, do it right now. My closet is clean. Um, enough is enough. Let's have girl time. Let's try some new makeup products. Ah, I'm so excited. We're gonna try the products that we went shopping for yesterday. Let's get into it. Tinted moisturizer has hyaluronic acid, lightweight, non greasy, sheer to medium. I know that's right. Okay, let's try it. Apply directly to. All right. Okay. Okay. All right. Let me work fast. So let's just get to blending, shall we? Is this going to be too light for me? Oh my God, is this gonna be too light for me? This is always my problem with, okay, tell me if anybody else has this problem with tinted moisturizers. It feels like the shade range is always weird with tinted moisturizers, BB creams, CC creams. I never have a problem finding a foundation shade. When it comes to a BB cream, a CC cream, a tinted moisturizer, I feel like my shade is all like I'm always in between a shade. I don't know. Maybe it's coincidental. Now that I've blended it out, it's actually matching. <laughs> I just got ahead of myself. Oh my God. Look, you guys saw how dark that dark spot was at first. It covered it pretty good. I mean, and I didn't use that much. Like that plump was enough for my whole face. So I know it came out looking like a lot, but it really was not that much. <laughs> Okay, I'm pleasantly surprised. I am like fighting for my life with my under eye bags. So like, just ignore that. I, I think it's just a side effect of this pregnancy because I don't typically have an issue with my under eye bags, but here we are. I am digging this. I'm not gonna put a ton of makeup on either. Like, I'm about to just do concealer, mascara, call it a day. Okay, the alleged Dior lip oil dupe by e.l.f. I love this age we're in of rebranding lip glosses as lip oils. Baby, that's a lip gloss. But, oh, she's so pretty, I'm sorry. Um. The consumerism has got me, cause babe, this is gorgeous. This is just a lip gloss. This is just a lip gloss. 
I mean, it's fine though. Just a little close. I have the Rare Beauty Concealer on with the Beauty Bakery Setting Powder on top of the Tinted Moisturizer by Wet n Wild. Love it. This is like, this is exactly what I needed. Ah, it feels so cute. This is exactly what I needed. Okay. I'm about to chill out. I have to do some choreography for my classes this week. Like I have to get it done today, period. I have to I have to get at least some of it done today. But I'm about to sit down for a little bit because y'all saw how much, well you guys didn't see all of what I did today, but like y'all saw I was up, I was busy. I cooked breakfast, I just kept going, going, going. And it's now 2.07. Chow, I'm tired. Your girl is tired. So I'm about to sit down and do nothing for at least an hour and a half because it's what I deserve. Good morning, guys. Happy Tuesday. If you are a consistent vlog viewer, you know Tuesdays is crazy. Tuesdays are my most hectic days of the week because I teach at two studios today and it is my second longest day of the week right behind Saturday. I have a very long drive to get to the first studio. Hold on, baby. I have a very long drive to get to the first studio. I have to also drop my daughter off to be babysat. Um, I like to take my time with my morning routine with my daughter and cook her breakfast every morning. So on Tuesdays, I have the options of waking up really early to get that done or going to Dunkin'. Today is a Dunkin' day. Okay, I am all ready for the day just for work. Got my jewelry on and Aurora is dressed as well. Say hi, Aurora. Hi. I'm about to get her shoes on and then we are headed out. Let's go, girl. Say, let's go. Yes, we're gonna go get a donut. Okay, I have dropped Aurora off. So she is with the sitter. We had Dunkin' for breakfast. I had a glazed donut, a snack and bacon, and hash browns. Aurora had a chocolate donut and snack and bacon. And I had a medium sweet iced tea with, I told him to put two pumps of liquid sugar, but it's not giving that this is water so yeah it was still i mean i still drink it obviously it wasn't bad but it's just not as sugary as i thought it was gonna be it is currently 10 58 i work at 11 30 but the studio i teach at this morning is right around a corner from a sephora so i'm gonna walk into sephora and just look i'm just looking babe i'm just looking okay let's go into sephora real quick do a little scope we, we scoping out the scene we just seeing what's going on no matter where I'm going I have to be there early all the time no exception so I left Sephora so that I could be to work early even though it was right around the corner I left Sephora so I could be to work early and I'm probably gonna end up going back to Sephora to look at some more stuff but I definitely want to buy the uh, pink jet set so yeah Sephora I'll be back but I am at work at the first studio um, being a dance teacher while also being pregnant is such a unique thing <laughs> but I feel good today like I feel able to move I'm gonna like do some turns and stuff um, while I wait for my classes to start because I'm pretty much I'm pretty much ready um, and I left this tea on my car last night thank god it tastes better than the Dunkin tea honestly teach three classes three different age groups hold on side note my nails are still on the nail glue is linked down below because I'm not joking when I say you need it it is currently Tuesday and I did my nails on you guys I'm not joking I did my nails on Friday night can you see that I did my nails Friday night 
it's Tuesday and my nails are still on. I have not had to re a nail. I wash dishes, I shower, I bathe my daughter. I do both of our hair. I finally found a good nail glue, y'all. I'm gonna have to pry these press-ons off. I've never tried a nail glue like this before. Like, this is crazy. <laughs> I'm so excited, okay. I'm going on Shein to order press-ons. <laughs> I'm definitely gonna go to Shein to order more press-ons because nail salon who? As you guys saw, we did fried rice and egg rolls for dinner. They were literally so good. I'm being quiet because Brandon is asleep, but I am done my nighttime routine. Before we end this vlog, I wanna remind you guys that 82% of people who watch don't subscribe to my videos. That's weird, that's suspicious. So if you're watching this and you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe so I can catch you in the next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in my next video, hopefully. Bye.